another show for MFA, which is a very good sign for the local um, uh, live performance industry. So that's the reason why we decided that the time is right for us to do a big festival featuring um, the Nusantara region artists. Uh, basically, Nusantara Fest is a short form for, uh, from Nusantara. We're featuring artists from uh, Malaysia, Indonesia and uh, Singapore. So I'll quickly um, run through um, what Nusantara Fest is all about. Um, Basically, uh, Nusa Fest is a music and cultural festival. Um, it's, uh, it features the, the leading artists from the Nusantara region, uh, like I mentioned uh, earlier. Malaysia, Singapore and Indonesia. Uh, we've got just the food booths, we have about close to 200 uh, booths uh, that's going to be featuring um, food from the region. And also, there'll be uh, handicrafts and uh, arts from the region as well. Um, for the lifestyle product showcase, it's basically products. Uh, we've got what, close to 300 booths as well that uh, the vendors can feature their products. Uh, as our festival venue, because for a festival, I think it's a perfect venue. There's, there's something in the, in the place. There's a huge space for the music area for both the stages doable. So we've got 18 artists. Uh, I think you've seen uh, the lineup that we've got. Um, uh, we're going to have two stages side by side. So how the performance is going to start out? Promo, Exist the Union, 420, Gerhanes Kachinta, Iqbal M, Joe Fizzo, Kate Lick, Kelompok Penerbang Rocket, Malik and the Essentials, Padi Ribbon, Raisa, Rusty Blade, Seringai, Slang, and Toulouse. If you look at the lineup, this is, I think crazy is an understatement. Um, as you know, with the coronavirus, which has been widely spreading, um, we are postponing the festival to a later date. Um, the, the dates that we're looking at is uh, July 2020. As much as we don't want to postpone this, we will have to do this mainly because two reasons. Um, one is public safety. Um, we can have a festival any any time that we want, but if anything goes wrong with, with the current uh, scenario with the virus spreading like a wildfire, it's just too risky for us to proceed. If you even if you look at if you read the news everywhere, even the Singapore Air Show has been scaled down. Even is just the sheer effort of Shiraz Productions, the fact that uh, Shiraz is taking the risk to bring such a genre, not just such a genre, but mm -hmm. a genre in music into one big festival is something that can take the time of plot I think we want to run more plot one time. Yeah, but I mean, you can see that our artists, artists, veteran and artists, Badu in one platform mm -hmm. and to celebrate the art and music. I think that's just really something that is um, kind of positive for the industry, not just for the industry, but for um, artists, artists and artists uh, who perform. Okay. We all know, I mean, the economy is tough, but the fact that Shiraz is putting everyone together, for the art is just something amazing. One, two, go!